Back on the old Patagonia Express, I was traveling north from the town of Esquel, skirting the foothills of the Andes. Patagonia has always been remote. It feels a bit like the end of the world. European settlers only really arrived here in the 19th century. They forced many of the locals from the land and created endless farms. In recent years, wealthy Europeans, Americans and foreign companies have bought up many of these ranches. I was on my way to one of the largest in the country. At 186,000 hectares, it's bigger than Greater London. It's owned by Patagonia's largest landowner, the Benetton family, owners of the giant Italian clothing company. Benetton's ranch manager is descended from Scottish immigrants. His name is Ronald MacDonald. So Ronnie, tell us what's special about these sheep. The sheep you can see are Italian merino sheep, a breed renowned for their wool production. We want to see how the, the fine fibres on, on the flute. Stop, please. All right, I think Ronnie's actually going to try and catch one of the sheep because if we all go over there, it's going to be impossible. I presume he's using the technique of sneaking up on them slowly. All right, so come on, we've got one's been caught. Let's go and have a look at them. See what makes them special. It's basically a fine, soft wool, and above all, it has a good colour. Buen color, sí. And from these sheep, you get some of the finest wool in the world. Some expensive jumpers. Listo, Benito. Listo, listo. He's off. The sheep from these Patagonian ranches provide around 15% of all the wool that goes into Benetton clothes around the world. 